Hello, good morning everybody. Welcome to the English lesson. I hope you are always grateful and even help. I'm Julia. Today we are going to learn English. Our topic today is the usage of simple present tense. Why do we need to learn this material? Yeah, this material is used when we want to express our daily activities. The goal of learning is the students are able to express their daily activities using simple present tense problem. Okay, now open your book on page 2. There are three discussions here. First, the usage of simple present tense. Second, the formulation. The third, the usage of adverb of frequency in simple present tense. Now, the usage of simple present tense. We use simple present tense one, to talk about habits and routines. Examples A. We study for two hours every night. B. I have meals twice a day. Let's see the word study and have meals. It means our daily activities or our routine in our daily lives. 2. To talk about packs and states. Examples. A. A cat has four legs. Has four legs shows facts. B. Where do you come from? This sentence shows about state. 3. To talk about feelings and opinions. Examples. A. Anna loves working out. B. I think grammar is very important. Let's say the word loves working out that shows feeling and I think grammar is very important that shows opinion. Now, we are going to discuss about the formulation. In English, pronouns are divided into two. Plural subjects and singular subjects. A. Using plural subjects, they, we, I, you. If you want to change this sentence into affirmative, so we can write subject plus verb one plus object or complement. And then subject plus do not plus verb one plus object or complement in negative sentence. Do plus subject plus verb one plus object or complement in questions box. Examples. I study two hours every night. I do not study two hours every night. Do I study two hours every night? Two, using singular subjects, he, she, it. If you want to change this into affirmative, subject plus verb plus s or es plus object or complement. In negative sentence, subject plus does plus not plus verb or plus object or complement. And does plus subject plus verb one plus object or complements in question forms. Examples. Anne loves working out. Anne does not love working out. Does Anne love working out? Now, we are discussed to the third the usage of adverb of frequency in simple present tense. Adverb of frequency is used to talk about how often we do things. 
Okay, now you can see this. Now you can see the position of adverb of frequency in the sentences below. One, he always reads in the evening. Two, they are often late for class. Three, sometimes I worry about future. Four, she never cries in front of us. Five, I usually drink milk before bed. As a note for you, commonly we add S for singular subject. But sometimes we add ES like this. So the conclusion is, if you want to express your daily activities, you can use simple present tense easily by more practice. As motivation for you, do your best at very opportunity that you have. Okay, that's all our topic today. I hope it will be useful for you. And good morning.